My name is Lisa Ann Withrich Curlis. I was born in Logan, Utah, and I currently live in Bountiful, Utah. I have four children. I have a 13-year-old son, a 10-year-old daughter, a 7-year-old daughter, and a 5-year-old daughter. A year ago, on May 27th, our family suffered a tragedy. My husband of 15 years and father of my four children passed away. When my husband passed away and after, you know, we had kind of a week's period of things resonating and settling and finding out where I was, um, I learned that we were going to lose our home and that we were losing all of our cars, that there was no money in the bank, that you know, financially we were completely stripped of everything. And as the mother of four children, I had to figure out what my next step was going to be and how I was going to be able to support my family and, and be able to take care of my children. I made the decision to go back to school and get my education. Currently I am in my second semester of college. I am doing my generals right now and um, I'm moving towards going into the dental hygienic field due to the fact that I still have young children at home and being you know, a single parent, I feel it's really important to be home with my children as much as possible and that field seems to be conducive with, with the things that I need to be able to financially provide for my family and also be able to be home and raise my children as much as possible. Ultimately, I think for the next year, I just want my kids, you know, to be able to go to school and to maintain their grades and, and to heal through this. Everyone in their life obviously suffers with tragedy and has things that they have to deal with. And right now as a mother, I'm just trying to make sure that, that my children are, move forward with their lives and are as healed as much as I can possibly heal them. The night that I received the phone call that I had won this Seroptimus Women's Opportunity Award was on the one year anniversary of my husband's passing and it was definitely a high note in a very dark period in my life. Out the get-go, winning the award makes it, allows me to be able to go to school to get my degree and, and helps pay with you know day-to-day -day expenses, utility bills, clothes for the kids, groceries, those kinds of things. And so it's, it's a good, I mean, it's an amazing miracle to have to win that award and have that, that little bit of security that makes it so I can go to school and kind of lets me have a breath as I try to, you know, put myself in a financial position that I can take care of my kids. I've been amazed at the love and support and rallying from the Seroptimus community, women and people that I don't even know that I've never met championing me on and supporting me and just the whole beauty of that community and of that program and that how they move forward and they they not only financially help women but they in spirit kind of reach down and and take you by the hand and pull you up and encircle you with love and give you hope and faith for tomorrow. I had everything taken away and I really saw some amazing, beautiful parts of humanity come out and had a lot of those things touch me and kind of put me in a place where I feel like the need to pay it forward, that I have received so much and hopefully the, the lessons and the things that I'm learning from this experience, I will be able to go forward and and help other people and, and be able to reach out and pull someone else up and say, you know, I've been there, I know what that feels like and you can do this. Mm -hmm.